Hi, if you've been struggling with the installation of your $7 secret script, I'd like to take you through the proper installation of the script in this video to help you get up and running as quickly as possible. So let's get started. As you can see, I have the script downloaded here. And this is version 2.8, which is the latest um, version of the script, which you can, you, you can download if you've purchased a product. I'm going to right mouse click and select extract. Here we have the folder that's been created. And within this folder is the content of our script. But what I like to do is I like to take and rename this folder to the name of my product. And for the purpose of this video, simply going to call it new $7 product. Okay, and there we have it. Now let's take a look at the content of the folder. Looking at the content of the folder, I see we have several files at the root, and we also have an image file, uh, uh, pardon me, an image folder and a templates folder. Okay, now one of the files that we'll be using to get everything set up and properly configured is our config.php file. So we'll be using that uh, shortly. We also have the settings file, which the config file actually will populate with the proper settings. We have our IPN file, which uh, will be used in, during the sales process. And we have our index.php file, which actually is the, uh, the brains behind how the script actually works. Okay, so now let's take a look at the templates folder. The templates folder is where all of the HTML files that actually uh, describe our products, such as the squeeze page and the, uh, the one-time offers and so forth, this is where all that information is contained. We also have a couple of emails that are sent out for various uh, purposes during the, 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 the purchase process. And then um, we also have a couple of other files. Now, in total, we have about 11 TXT files. You'll also notice at the very top that we have a sales letter.html.dat file. Okay, this is a data file which information is written to um, during the process of, of our customers using. Uh, our script to purchase our products. Okay, so um, if you've downloaded the script and extracted it, and if you're comparing the content of this folder to what I have, you may notice that there's a couple of files missing. Okay, if there is, uh, don't panic. All right, don't panic. It's easy enough to correct the problem and get yourself up and running in no time. So I'd like you to compare the list of what you have in your templates folder to what you currently see here um, in this video. If any of the files are missing, for example, the most likely files to be missing are these that have a 0 KB size, okay? And that tends to be a problem with, uh, with some of the zip programs not actually processing 0 KB size uh, of files. So if uh, some of these files are missing, now would be a good time to simply pause the video and generate the files that you currently don't have. You can use a regular text editor such as Notepad, simply create a new text file and rename it to the name of the file that you happen to be missing. And when you have all of the files, we'll proceed to the next step.